Hello friends, welcome back to Cat Practice. Today we are going to construct a basic model of kitchen sink in Autodesk Inventor software. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and create. Now go to 2D sketch and we'll select the exit plane, rotate this view. This will be the top plane. Now from here select two point center rectangle and select the center point. Now make a rectangle. Now go to dimensions. The horizontal dimension will be 240 mm and the vertical dimension here will be 140 mm. Okay. Now go to fillet command and take a fillet of 20 mm and select all the edges first, second, third, and this last fourth. Okay, now exit from this command. Now go to 3D model and select extrude command. Now the extrude is going upwards, but we want to change the direction. So from here, go to direction 2 and here the distance will be 80 mm and ok. Now select top face, go to create sketch, rotate the view. Now go to rectangle command and this time we will select two point rectangle make a rectangle over here now go to dimensions the horizontal dimension will be 120 mm and the vertical dimension will be 110 mm ok the distance from the outer edge will be 15 mm ok Escape. Now drag this rectangle inside and distance from outer edge here also 15 mm. Okay. Now select the fillet command and take a radius 20 here also. This edge 20, this 20 this also 20 and this also 20 ok now finish sketch and go to extrude command here it is going upward but we want to cut the profile so select here cut and give this dimension as 77 mm ok the cut will be till here and ok go to home so this will be the cut profile now select this face go to create sketch we go to project geometry and select the outer edge or you can select this face the uh, this project profile is being projected now finish sketch uh, do one thing go to sketch once again and from here select offset and select this outer edge right click and select loop we have already selected escape go to offset and select this profile and give an offset of 3m ok so correct here the dimension this will be 3 mm once again. Okay. Now finish sketch. Go to extrude command and select the profile. Flip this direction and give the dimension 3. Flip the direction from here. Now you can see after 3 mm we have selected the inner profile. Okay. Go to home and we will cut this profile and ok 
this is the 3 mm depth ok now select this face go to create sketch now from here select center to center slot make a slot profile here go to dimensions give center to center distance as 65 mm and here the radius will be 7 mm ok now the, this center distance from this edge will be 20 mm now go to horizontal constraint select this center point and select center point of slot now this is fully constrained sketch here you can see fully constrained now go to rectangular pattern select this slot go to direction 1 select this line for direction and the gap between each slot will be 20 and the count here will be of 3 and now go to direction 2 select this line again for direction this time flip the direction and same values 20 is gap and count of 3 ok now ok finish sketch and go to extrude command select these profiles we will take an extrude of 3 mm and ok now we will give the radius so select this bottom edge go to fillet here give a radius of 1 mm similarly we will select all the bottom edges ok and we will select this top edge also select this edge this and this ok and apply now give here radius of 10 mm select edge and we will select this bottom edge ok apply now here change the radius to 5 mm go to edge and select this top edge and apply now take the radius as 1 mm and we will select this edge and apply ok now the important command the shell go to shell command select this and select this ok now give a shell of 2 mm thickness and apply ok now you can see this profile from bottom and the top view ok go to home now we will uh, select this face go to create sketch here go to circle command and make a circle in between of dia 25 mm go to horizontal constraint select this point select this point for vertical constraint select the center point and select this point ok now go to 3d model select x2 flip the direction to cut you can see the cut profile and ok now go to top view you can see the cut profile over here ok now this is the view oh. uh, select this bottom edge also and go to fillet and give a fillet of 1 mm apply ok I think all profiles we have completed now you can assign it any color or material you can assign it uh, I will take this time silver or you can give silver polished you can steel polish you can give ok 
so this was the basic tutorial to how to construct a 3d model of kitchen sink in autodesk inventor i hope you like the video if you do that please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you